Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, then a little introduction. This is a place to share stories, adventures, and everything I wish I'd known before embarking on them. My name is Drina, and you're watching From Fiji to Here. It's editing Drina here. I forgot to film the intro on my way to the airport, but I did want to give some backstory because it, this video is going to be more of a vlog style. Um, it's going to cover the weekend that Nicole came to visit us here in Montreal. So Nicole lives in Halifax, where Elisa was born and where we lived for the past six years, I think, or where I lived for the past six years. And so, yeah, we will take you through um, some of the top sites to see if you are only here for a short period of time, like a weekend. But also, I just wanted to capture the memories for Elisa. It's been a year and a half. I guess pretty much 19 months. This is not the first time Nicole has met Elisa. I'll insert some of those pictures here. Um, but because we did move when she was about five weeks old, it's when we left Halifax, Nicole has not seen her in person since. So I want to keep these memories for us as well. See you in the video. After a short introduction and some very fun dance parties, Elisa was more than warmed up enough to Nicole. So we had it out for dinner at the number one place to get a poutine here in Montreal, La Bonne We're both gonna have to have a bath. <laughs> Where's your plate? Where's your plate? Where's Lisa's?
Mummies. And look, look at mummies. Delicious. Oh, yum. That's mummies. After finishing our waffles, Elisa went down for a nap, and Nicole and I headed out to my next favorite thing, the Boda Boda Spa. We also saw this performance of along the way. I'm not too sure what it was, so if you know, do let me know down below. Um, but yeah, that's one of the things I love about Montreal. There's always something going on. Oh yes, and there's no pictures allowed to be taken at the spa, so see you after. Here's Nicole. Hi. How did you like the spa? It was lovely, very relaxing, very serene. Now I want a nap. <laughs> <laughs> but the night has just begun. Yay! The only Kentucky thing, like, I don't know, the Sensi Spa in Halifax. Mm -hmm. Can you bring your phone in? Yes, you can. Okay. Yeah, there's no, so, no rules about that's kind of sucky. Yeah. And the one in Iceland, which I am forgetting the name. Yeah. You can also bring your phone. The blue lagoon? Yes. Yeah, yeah. The blue lagoon. You yeah. can also bring your phone and things like that. Yeah. This one, no. In which, fact, I, to be honest with you, I kind of like the no phone. Because yeah. Because I just like. You can really disconnect. I really, con I really disconnected. Yeah. So, so. It was, I mean, my first thing I did was I picked up my phone. Pros and cons. <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> so it was nice. Just yeah. to know if you want to go there. Yeah. I <laughs> definitely recommend. Girls. <laughs> Say cheese. Cheese. Show that to mom. Show that to mom. If you're happy and you know it, say cheese. No, no, show mama. Show mama. Elisa, show me your cheese. Yes, show mama your cheese. If you're happy and you know it. Ready? Show mom. Show mom. Show mama. If you're happy and you know it, say cheese. 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 If you're happy and you know it, say cheese. <laughs> oh my god! And if you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it, if you're happy and you know it, say cheese. Cheese. The next morning, Elisa felt like making us breakfast yet again, so we let her do that and then ate and headed out on our next adventure, which is stop number three, the Jean Talon Market.
Ravelli. <laughs> wow. Woo! One, two, three. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. Ready? Good job. Thank you. <gasps> Elisa, what do you have? What do you have? Wow. Shake it off. Shake it. Shake it, dude. Scotia because there's so much history. 